Sugar Ashley. Sorry about my appearance. I just got back from the doctor's office. I had to do a heart ultrasound. I'll let you know all that stuff when I do an update. Um, so I wanted to come home and do hashtag Friday reads where you tell what you're gonna read for the weekend. I am super excited with the books that I have. I am coming waiting to post a book haul. I'm just waiting for a couple more books to come in the mail that I ordered off of eBay. Hopefully they come soon because I really do want to do a book haul. Um, the first book that I'm reading, I have been reading, is Lick by Kylie Scott. I got this at Target. That's my new place for contemporary books. I'm on page 38. I read this whenever I'm on the bus. It is about this girl, Evelyn. She goes to Vegas for her 20th, 20th or 21st? 21st birthday and wakes up with this guy David with a tattoo of his name on her butt cheek and she's married to him and he is a rock star and how they deal with that and it's really good i want to get the other books which is play lead and deep really really good you check this author out at target then i am reading i'm so excited to have it the second day it came out it arrived on my doorstep from walmart because i pre-ordered it and that was landline by rainbow rowell love it it's beautiful i am on page I've been taking this slow because I love Rainbow Row and I don't want to finish her book too quickly. Um, I'm on page 57. This is about a girl, uh, Georgia, I think her name, Georgia McCool, and she works at a company producing TV shows, and her husband, Neil, they had a plan to take their children to Neil's uh, parents' house to um there for christmas and she has to stay home neil goes her marriage is kind of in peril and she finds a yellow rotary rotary phone i think is what you call it and it's a magical phone that allows her to talk to neil i believe in in the past to try to fix her marriage i love rainbow rowell's adult books um and it just sounds really good i haven't got to the part yet where she uses the magical phone but it's so good. Like, I love this book to pieces. So those are the two books that I'm going to be reading this weekend. Um, and just tell me what you are reading down below. All right, guys. Keep calm. Read on. Bye.